Suicide of Doom 616 here, and today we have a very special cap package from the UK. For those of you who know the band Him, they are from Helsinki, Finland, and they are my favorite band in the whole entire world. And they just released a new album. As you can see in the back, I have the vinyl, the Newberry Comics signed booklet, um, the actual DCs. I've got two of these DVDs, my mom. CDs, DVD thing, my mom's listening to the CD. And then two limited edition Tears on Tape singles. And right here we have the limited hammer, metal hammer, limited edition collector's pack, fan pack. It actually is very nice. It has some reflective in the hymn. The CD is almost like popping out. And it looks really nice. This is a 132 pages, a whole hymn. Um, it has a giant poster too as well, and it's all edited by Bill Vallo himself. And I'm just making this video just for the, every all the fans and stuff who, you know, couldn't get it or haven't received it yet. Um, looks very nice on the back, very nice organized. Has the full CD here. Um, all 13 tracks and then bonus tracks include Buried Live by Love and Kiss at Dawn. Yes, they are both live. And then exclusive download tracks, Wings of a Butterfly. All this stuff in recorded in limited edition, but, um, looks like it's very, and it's actually, like, in this, like, hard plastic cover, which is really nice, so let's just pretty much just open it up, and I'll, um, flip through the pages a little bit. My favorite track on the album is, um, the last, no, no, track 12, which is called... When Love Starts to Die. It's an amazing, definitely, it's got him all the way through. Oh, wow, this is really nice. Oh, I forgot about it, too. Forgot about that. Good. Oh, oh wow. It's, um, it's hard-covered versus, you know, this one over here is paper. This is actually, like, a hard-covered book, which is really cool. We got the album art in the back. Oh, wow, this is a lot nicer. It would actually be pretty cool if the CD came like this, but you know what? It's probably better for us. Who people we got the limited edition. Comes in almost this little, um, little like almost like letter kind of thing. I'm trying to think where the CD itself is. I don't know if this is the CD or oh, you know what? Yeah, this is the CD. And it has the bonus tracks on it, and then you can download the other tracks. That's what it is. But this is extremely nice. Very nice with the whole hardcover. Um, casing. This is the drawstring bag. I totally forgot about this. I'll open this up. Can use this for school, and seems like a nice like vinyl. Um, it's a little small, to be honest with you. A little small, but it's still nice. It's got the Tears on Tape symbol. And uh, there goes all my shit. Yep. You know, maybe if I do this, you guys can see it better. You can see the actual height of it. Seems okay. Kind of wish it was bigger, but I I'll find a use for it. I bet other people will, too. Um, oh, so nice. Is this the front? Yeah, this is the front. It's got the whole band, probably in somewhere in their hometown. Black and white cover, too, which is really nice. Um, it's all, all in English. It's got... This is, uh, for those of you who know, Danny Filth from Cradle of Filth. I think he just introduces him and stuff. Uh, figured this stuff would have some... Advertisement from other stuff, which is perfectly fine, because... Oh, it's got some old dark light pictures in it. This is very good for, you know... Oh, that one's cool, too. If you guys can see him. He's got kind of like a mask on. You know, I won't go through the whole thing. I'll just flip through a couple pages and stuff. Probably talking about some of their idols and stuff. Each band member probably has their own biography, and... He's got some extra artwork. Mie. Oh wow. 
This is really nice. It's got some really good detailed photos, and it was worth it. You know, it was only it was only a couple bucks, or not a couple, but oh, that's cool. Um, end pack. It says farewell right here with Mr. Vallo himself. Um, yeah, it was only seventeen dollars for me. This is the back with the amps that they have on stage, the decals on them. I'm gonna take a guess that this is the poster. Oh, we got two posters? Oh wow, there's a couple posters. Let me open these up on the floor so you guys can get a good view of them. Oh, wow, it's the whole band too. You know, they don't have too many photos of the whole band. Maybe all the lyrics, it's here's on tape. No, it's a little hard to see, but that's a pretty cool poster, just if you wanted it from that side. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it looks like, you know, the lyrics to the song, there may be... Oh no, this is everyone's name. This is everyone's name that was in the poster, who, people who signed up early got their name, um... Printed on the poster, which is really cool. I'm definitely not going to find mine now. I'm pretty sure I got mine in there, but I will look for it later. But that's really cool. I thought it was lyrics, but no, it's everyone's name who pre-ordered it early. So that is very cool. That's very cool. That's dedication right there. This is the other amazing side. Yeah, see, so like I said, they don't have a lot of... It's very big, too. You know? Um... Like, this, this this is, like, the normal, that's, you know, standard CD size. So, you guys would get a pretty nice sideways one. They all look pretty badass. Um, just put that over there. We have a, It looks like we have another poster, too. Let me just put you guys down for a bit. Oh, you know what? This is, must be the door poster. It's got all their idols on it. Look how massive this is. Now you can see how big it is. Compared to the rest of it. It looks like it has all their favorite artists. All their um, inspirations. Um, yeah, see Cradle of Filth. Danny, Danny Filth. Christopher Lee. Um, we got Chris Isaac right here. <laughs> Iggy Pop and Edgar Allan Poe, which is really cool because I, uh, I just did a paper on Edgar Allan Poe. And I used some of all HP Lovecraft, Johnny Cash. This is really nice, and it's got the whole symbol. It says, um, hymns, gods, and monsters. That's really cool. I'll come here and, oh, you know what? Wasn't even folded out all the way. This is it. Still have another thing, so. You guys can actually see now how long it is. It's very nice. Definitely. A door poster, I was thinking, like, you know, sideways, you know, long, but not that long. Oh, this is for all you ladies. This is for all you ladies. Uh. Nice big tall one, looks like he's actually at your door. He does have pants on, I'm sorry, ladies, but this is extremely nice. Really nice. Personally, I think I would just go with the other side, but this is very nice. Um... I guess that's pretty much it. It's definitely, I believe that there are a couple left to buy, and I definitely would jump on it. Because this is an extremely, like I said, $17. I would pay $17 just for the poster of the band. So, it's very good, and it's something for any fan to really have for, you know, the magazine. It's just something to have and, you know, look back on. But, um, thank you for watching. And, hope you guys really enjoy the album, because I am, so... Thank you for watching and have a great day.